naked. Once I wished on a star and it flew in my window cup blue. Now I can have any wish I want, but only once a week. Yo, baby! Wishing's what I like. What's the big fuss about Goyle? Me, I can take him or leave him, but not that wimpy Nick. He's gotta go fall in love with the wrong Goyle. Boy, is he gonna be dead me. All right, class, settle down. We're ready to begin the tryouts for next week's play. I wonder what part would be right for me, Nick. I don't know about you, Daryl, but I want to be the star. That means playing the role of Peter Pan. Don't even think about it, McQuarrie. I'm getting the lead in this play. You try out for Peter Pan, and I'll make peanut butter out of you. <laughs> and what part would you like to try out for, Nick? Uh, I'll play the peanut butter. What? Oh, Mrs. Kimberly? Yes, Sonny? Is Wendy the girl that Peter Pan falls in love with? Yes, she is. Oh, my gosh. Then that's the part I want to play. That's the cutest girl I've ever seen in my life. I heard she just moved into the neighborhood and that she hangs out with Frankie Duckweiler. I don't care. I've got to meet her. Huh? Huh? will be Peter Pan, and Frankie will be Captain Hook. But, Mrs. Kimberly, I don't want to be... Now, who would like to try out for Tinkerbell? The opening night of this play is gonna be the closing night of your life, McClary. Come on, Sonny, let's get out of here. Sign of Frankie anywhere in the neighborhood. I think I'm in love. No, not with you, slobber. What am I gonna do, Daryl? If I play Peter Pan, I get to be with the cutest girl in the whole world. Until I'm chopped into dog meat by Frankie Duttweiler. There's someone coming down the street. Is it Frankie? No, it's just some girl. Oh, shh. Girl? <gasps> It's her, and she's looking right at us. <sighs> I'll bet she likes me. Either that, or she'd like to see you dead. Huh? You can't hide, McCleary! Oh, no. Frankie's coming into your backyard. He's climbing up! Quick, wish Frankie on the dark side of Mars! 
course. I'll do better than that. I wish I was Hulk Hogan, so I could impress Sonny while I'm pulverizing Frankie. I wish I was Hulk Clary. I wish I was Hulk Clary. I wish you loved me. You forgot about Frankie! And I ah! know you, McClary, you'll never forget me! Hey! Let's play toss the geek, McClary! Ah! Don't you hurt a hair on his head, Francis Duttweiler? Why not? Because I love him. You do? Yikes! Huh? Time to activate the treehouse security system. Nothing, really. Maybe. But when Frankie comes back, it's gonna be something. Nick? Everything okay? Just fine, Dad. Who is your new friend, Nick? Oh, this is Sunny. She's co-starring with me in the school play. Ooh. Hey, that's great, Nick. I'll shoot some pictures of you and do a local interest story in the paper. Me? In the newspaper? Wow! That'll really impress her. Great, Nick. Why don't you just take out an ad asking Frankie to annihilate you? Don't you worry about that big buffoon Frankie. You're much more of a man than he'll ever be. Who, me? Worry about Frankie? Ha! Huh. He doesn't scare me at all. Oh, brother. Huh. Oh, Nicky, why don't you come over to my house for dinner tonight? You can't, Nick. We've got to study for our geography quiz. Get real, Daryl. The only geography I care about is your address. See you at five. Bye. Bye. Huh? Earth to Nick. Oh, brother. How do I look, Daryl? Fine, as long as you don't mind getting blood stains on your new suit. Will you stop worrying? Frankie isn't even going to know. It's almost five. You're gonna be late. No way. Sonny lives just down the block. I'll walk you there. Then you're on your own. So, where does the love of your life live? 86 Elm. There's something awfully familiar about that address. You didn't say 86 Elm Street, did you? Yeah, why? Yikes! Ow! There must be some mistake. There's no mistake. It's, it's Frankie Duttweiler's house! house. Ah! Well, I'm out of here. What are you doing here, Dip Dick? Why, he's coming over to have dinner with me. What? What? I mean, well, what are you doing at Frankie's house, Sonny? We just moved into town from Ohio. My folks and I are staying here until we can find our own house. You're staying with Frankie? Why not? She's my cousin, you dweebazoid. <gasps> C cousin Oh, no! I'm a rat food! What are you waiting for, you handsome hunk? Dinner's almost ready. Our folks aren't home yet, so I made it for you myself. Not so fast, McClary. You set one foot on my property, and you're gonna be coming to dinner as the main course. Uh, can we have dinner a little later? Like when I'm about three feet taller? What's the matter? Don't you love me? Uh, sure I do. You go inside. I'll be with you in a few minutes. 
Uh, you win, Frankie. I'm going home. Ha! What a chicken. I'll just sneak in the back way. Get it, boy. <laughs> Go inside and get something else to chew on, dude. Boy, the things people do for love. Would it make a difference if I told you I was invited? If McClary shows his face around here again, we'll waste him. Perfect.